Hello, people of YouTube. My name is JD Shadow, and apologies for not getting these out sooner, but let's get to it. This is the fifth, fifth episode of Miraculous Ladybug. Copycat is the name of this one. They're showing them a bit out of order, but they maybe, maybe they're just showing the first five episodes out of order, where maybe the order doesn't really matter. But anyway, let's get to it. Episode five. Mm -hmm. You know, I've thought maybe it was like Kim Possible, but she sounds like Kim Possible. You're blindfolded, pretty much. There is a very simple solution, Marionette. It's called a cell phone. You just need a number. I know what um, she hasn't gotten it yet. What are you doing, Marinette? What are you doing? And she's in a pop uh, lollipop. It was natural when I read, then memorize it. It's pretty simple. You can do this. Just got it memorized. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, you bitch. Hello, uh, Adrian's voicemail. Uh, <laughs> who, uh, Adrian's voicemail. <laughs> you talk to a robot at this point. She took a perfect shot and it hit nothing that would cause it to break. Oh no! <laughs> Rip Marinette. A f phone went to voicemail. It means the dude's busy, which also means you can get to it before he does. I wonder where he'd be. At home, maybe. After school, that's why he didn't pick up. It ends in exactly twenty-two and a half minutes. Uh, stalker much? Playing ladybug and cat noir sculptures today. I totally spaced. Me too. Uh, you never mentioned going to the unveiling before. I mean, I am. Uh, I mean, I forgot. Listen, about Adrian's cell phone, what if we go right after? She did not pick up on it. You are dense, lady. Dense. Don't sweat it. I can manage. I think. You sure? Yes, yes, I'm sure. Cool. Good luck and stay out of trouble. And don't improv. Okay. Cat Noir, but Ladybug's not here. Don't worry about Ladybug. I'm sure she'll be here any minute. I can handle this situation alone for now. I'm the one in charge anyway, you know. Oh, wow. I wanna... Please, uh, just one minute more, Mayor Bourgeois. She's going to come. I can. Please. I thought he was about to say Mayor Bushwhacker. Oh, boy. I wish it was him. If you call him, you'll make his phone ring. Nice, Tiki. You are a stalker. You should be ashamed. <laughs> <laughs> you did. <laughs> Every single locker now take ages. Since when did you reveal that power? But you know, Ladybug and me were a thing. You know? Really? Yeah. Yeah, really? Oh no. Uh, she doesn't see anything in him. Out of time, and we really ought to be getting to that ceremony. Come on. Yeah, don't worry too much about it. You're gonna steal his phone. Ah, <laughs> you have his phone, and you haven't returned it yet. You don't deserve her. I do. Oh, you're uh, so jealous. Q. Adrian's father. It's Adrian. He's looking for his phone. <laughs> what if he tracks it? He'll figure out I still and I'll be arrested for grand theft. I'll spend the rest of my life in jail and worse. I'll never get to go to the movies with Adrian. <laughs> oh, Marinette, you really need to get your priorities in order. Uh, <laughs> and stop being paranoid. <laughs> wow. Don't mind me just stealing this painting. Go to business. Hey. What the hell? Oh wow! Well, at least he knows the part well. This painting is the cat's meow. He just does no guards or anything doing something about him. Hey, you die. Of course, Adrian would own one of these super CSI France. Cat Noir is a lot of things, but he's no thief. Yeah, he's your boyfriend or would be boyfriend. 
That looks like Da Vinci Code, the movie. Hey, I'm the real Cat Noir. I'm way slicker than that guy. Kitties in the slammer. I repeat, kitties in the slammer. Kitties in the slammer. That is not suspicious at all. Kitties in the slammer, Ladybug. Don't think you're gonna keep him in there. No, no, leave it to the experts, Ladybug. We've got it under control. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not everybody would just stop someone like Ladybug, somebody who's really well known to do thing. There's a what team? It just it's just seeming a little bit like the Vinci Code, actually. Mona Lisa gets stolen, and that's the same building. I thought you just said save his tit, which is might be appropriate, but still. The sculptor. How did I not see that jealousy coming a mile away? Yours or his? Ha <laughs> ha, so funny. <laughs> yeah, you were jealous, man. Oh, tell me where you are. No, this is between me and him. I got myself into this mess, so now I'm gonna get myself oh. out of it. Uh cat? She's got a tracker on him, and you're not in love with him. Cat's in the bag. That cat? Oh god. Well, you don't have this under control now. I don't get what Ladybug sees in you. <laughs> it's Chung Lee now trying to do a lightning kick. Really? Us? What? That we're, you know, he made a secret promise. Huh. Hmm? Uh, yes, of course. We never made a promise. <gasps> Copycat. Oh, what a smart. Miraculous. If I can't have you, you... then nobody will. You know, you could have just thought of thought of that in the Charm! beginning. A spoon. A spoon? What now you're the tick. To do? I told you I was better than him. Huh? But I'm better than both of you. <laughs> yeah, now you fair fight. Cat Noir, scratch attack. Gladly. I love a good cat fight. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she's been the cat fight. <laughs> well, what made you think of the tape? No. To go fishing. Okay. <laughs> that looked like she was gonna like hit somebody with the with the steel pipe. Wow, you. No more evil doing for you, little. You're into WWE at any point. I thought they could take you. What am I doing here? Ladybug? I'm sorry I couldn't make it this morning, Theo. Can you autograph it for me? Of course I can. You've got some. After she almost killed? Oh, she almost killed you? Your message has been erased. You know what? I'm going to tell him I found his phone. That'd be a good way to start up a conversation, wouldn't it? Then I'll invite him to the movies. That's my girl. Wow. You already moved to the movies. In here a thousand times. You need some time off. Hey, I know. Let's go to the movies tonight. Hey, dudes. Mind if a few friends tag along? Sure thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Yep, she's in heaven. Okay, so the idea behind a a doppelganger, also the love thing right now between Cat Noir and Ladybug got a little revealed here. Like, okay, well, you're both annoying me. You're both oh, driving me nuts. But I know that he would not lie to me. Very good investigation by Ladybug to figure out easily which one's which. I was worried, like, 
oh, he's me, or get him, get him, get him, like, oh, that whole classic thing, but up in the idea that Ladybug, or not Ladybug, Marinette, is trying to slowly but steadily go more into Adrian to try to ask him out or whatever, she's getting a little braver, braver, braver the more the series goes along. The biggest thing that I got out of this episode, other than the fact that, okay, the doppelganger and all that or stuff, is that the setting for these particular areas, the country that the show is based upon this France. The museum that Cat Noir, well, the copycat, stole Mona Lisa from was inside of that glass pyramid. Now, it took a minute for me to find it, but here it is. This is the movie that I thought of the very first thing when I saw the Louvre pyramid, which I researched about this, an actual pyramid in, in France, rather. You see, this right here, well, I've read the book and the, watch the movie, Louvera Pyramid right here. The Mona Lisa, which was the object of Leonardo da Vinci and many of the things that have transpired, you see the Mona Lisa there. That's what copycat stole. Like, what is going on? Is this some sort of shout out to da Vinci Code here? It is an actual thing in France and shows you just how smart these writers are being with this show. They know the way around French. It is not, they're not trying to make up places in France. This is an actual place in France, which is the Louvre Pyramid goes into the museum. There you go. There's there's the whole thing. Took me a minute to find it, but whatever. All in all, that's the right episode. A good villain this time. A very good storyline. Some sort of plot progression. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching. Thumbs up, subscribe. You should know what to do by now. Thank you very much for everybody who subscribed to me because of these videos. Thank you very much. My name is Shady Shadow, and of course that just happened.